Joan Bennett, a prominent figure in classic Hollywood, left an indelible mark on the silver screen. Her career spanned decades, and her contributions to the film industry continue to be remembered. Whether you hold a cherished memory associated with her performances or are intrigued by lesser-known facts about this iconic actress, Joan Bennett's impact on cinema is undeniable. Exploring the layers of her career unveils not just a talented actress, but a fascinating individual whose presence on screen resonates with audiences across generations. As we delve into the legacy of Joan Bennett, we invite you to share your most cherished memories or personal experiences related to this classic Hollywood actor. Your stories enrich the tapestry of her influence in the world of cinema. We would love to hear your anecdotes and reflections in the comments below. Joan Bennett, a notable actress, was part of the original cast of Dark Shadows, a gothic soap opera that ran from June 27, 1966 to April 2, 1971. Remarkably, she was one of only three cast members who appeared in every episode, marking her enduring presence in the series. Beyond her acting career, Bennett had familial connections in the entertainment industry. She was the younger sister of actresses Barbara Bennett and Constance Bennett, establishing a notable lineage in Hollywood. This background likely contributed to her early exposure to the world of film and theater. While known for her on-screen achievements, Joan Bennett had diverse interests outside of acting. Her hobbies included interior decorating, gardening, and dog breeding. Notably, she also had a penchant for collecting miniature model horses, showcasing a more personal and multifaceted side to her life. In summary, Joan Bennett's career spanned from the beginning to the end of Dark Shadows, showcasing her dedication to the iconic series. Her familial ties to the entertainment industry and varied hobbies outside of acting reveal a well-rounded personality. This brief glimpse into her life provides a starting point for exploring the depth and diversity of Joan Bennett's contributions to the world of entertainment. Joan Bennett's cinematic journey extends beyond her iconic role in Dark Shadows. Notably, she holds a unique record, having appeared in five films directed by Fritz Lang, a feat unmatched by any other American actor or actress who collaborated with the renowned director. Despite Lang's reputed difficulty as a director, Bennett's prolific partnership with him stands as a testament to her professional prowess. In addition to her on-screen achievements, Bennett found herself in the gossip columns, notably in Hedda Hopper's. This wasn't a one-sided affair, as Bennett, in a bold move, sent Hopper a skunk as a Valentine's Day gift in 1950, accompanied by a pointed note that read, You stink. This audacious act showcased Bennett's spirited personality and her ability to handle the pressures of Hollywood with a touch of humor and defiance. These fascinating aspects of Joan Bennett's career reveal a woman who not only excelled in her craft, but also navigated the complexities of the entertainment industry with resilience and a dash of irreverence. From her collaborations with Fritz Lang to her unconventional response to gossip column criticism, Joan Bennett's story is one of talent, tenacity, and a willingness to stand out in a crowd. Joan Bennett's extensive filmography, comprising 78 feature-length films, reflects her versatile acting career. Beyond her on-screen prowess, she actively engaged in political and social causes, aligning herself with the Hollywood Democratic Committee and the Hollywood Anti-Nazi League. Her commitment extended to supporting liberal movements, including the civil rights movement, and endorsing political figures such as Franklin D. Roosevelt, Henry Wallace, Adlai Stevenson, John F. Kennedy, Robert F. Kennedy, and Jimmy Carter. While recognized for her cinematic achievements, an intriguing aspect of Bennett's career involves a significant role offer in the 1985 film Cocoon. Director Ron Howard aimed to reunite co-star Don Amich with one of his former leading ladies, considering Bennett for the role of Beth McCarthy. However, she faced a dilemma influenced by her fourth husband, David Wilder, who believed the film resembled Invasion of the Body Snatchers and thought it beneath her dignity to work under the direction of O.P. Taylor or Richie Cunningham. Despite the success of Cocoon, the part ultimately went to Gwen Verdon. This dual perspective on Joan Bennett's career, from her impactful political activism to the intriguing behind-the-scenes decisions, adds layers to her legacy in the entertainment industry. It showcases a woman who not only left an indelible mark on the silver screen, but also made meaningful contributions to the socio-political landscape of her time. Joan Bennett's story is one of depth, engagement, and the complexities that shaped her remarkable journey in Hollywood. Joan Bennett, a versatile actress with a rich cinematic legacy, brought depth to the silver screen. 
Beyond her acclaimed roles, her family history added layers to her identity. In her 1970 autobiography, The Bennett Playbill, Joan revealed her connection to Morris W. Morris, her grandfather known as Lewis Morrison on stage. His English and well-off Spanish ancestry, coupled with his service as a lieutenant during the Civil War, showcased the diverse roots that influenced Joan's heritage. While Joan's impact on Hollywood is undeniable, her journey also took unexpected turns. In 1939, she was a finalist for the iconic role of Scarlett O'Hara in Gone with the Wind. Despite losing the part to Vivian Lee, a consolation prize was offered, a role for her oldest daughter, Diana. However, Joan, ever principal, declined the offer, recognizing the unsuitability of an 11-year-old for the role of Bonnie Blue Butler. Joan's life extended beyond the glitz of Hollywood. At the time of her passing, she embraced the joys of family, boasting 13 grandchildren. The anticipation of becoming a great-grandmother added a poignant chapter, as one of her grandsons and his wife expected twins, expanding the Bennett family legacy. Joan Bennett's narrative is more than a Hollywood tale. It's a mosaic of heritage, missed opportunities, and the warmth of family bonds. From her Civil War-era lineage to her steadfast decisions in the face of fame, Joan Bennett's story resonates with depth and nuance. Pregnant during the filming of Little Women, Joan Bennett added a unique dimension to her versatile career. Balancing her on-screen commitments with the impending arrival of her daughter, Melinda Markey, Bennett navigated the challenges of both professional and personal spheres. This chapter in her life exemplifies the resilience and dedication that define Bennett's journey in Hollywood. As Hollywood's youngest and sexiest grandmother at 39, Bennett shattered expectations. Her daughter's childbirth not only expanded the Bennett family legacy, but also garnered attention from none other than Marlene Dietrich. The former title holder graciously acknowledged Bennett's new status, expressing gratitude for the shift in the spotlight. This unexpected turn in Bennett's personal life sheds light on the intriguing intersections of fame and family. Beyond the glitz of Hollywood and the glamour of her filmography, Bennett's nearsightedness and preference for glasses when not in the public, I reveal the human side of a silver screen icon. These personal quirks, often overshadowed by her on-screen persona, add layers to the narrative of a woman who defied conventions both on and off the set. Joan Bennett's story is not just about her cinematic prowess. It's a tapestry woven with unexpected twists, family dynamics, and the subtle nuances that defined her as a person. From little women to the accolades of being Hollywood's youngest grandmother, Bennett's life is a testament to the depth and diversity that shaped her remarkable journey. As we bid adieu to this captivating journey through the cinematic tapestry of a remarkable artist, let us linger for a moment, pausing to reflect on the indelible mark left by an actress whose grace transcends the silver screen. Your sojourn through the realms of Joan Bennett's performances may have stirred emotions and kindled memories, much like a cherished melody echoing through the corridors of time. In the mosaic of narratives, Bennett's performances resonate as threads that weave tales of resilience, allure, and a nuanced understanding of the human condition. Perhaps you found solace in her nuanced portrayals, or her magnetic presence sparked a fire in your imagination. Now, as the curtain falls, we invite you to share your personal reflections, to let the echoes of your own experiences intertwine with the legacy of a woman whose artistry carved its place in the annals of entertainment. Your words are the brush strokes that paint a broader canvas, connecting souls across time and space through the shared appreciation of a talent that transcends generations. What scenes linger in your memory and which characters have taken residence in your heart? This is your stage to share, your moment to perpetuate the enchantment that Joan Bennett, with her craft, bestowed upon the world. As we embark on the final act of this narrative, we extend our gratitude for your time and attention. Thank you for joining us in this exploration of an artist's impact and for allowing the magic of storytelling to resonate in your thoughts. Until the next rendezvous with the wonders of cinema, let the legacy of Joan Bennett continue to inspire and captivate.